the two differences, okay, are, uh, or the main difference, let me put it that way, is the way the brain works. If you have somatic pain, first it has different attributes than visceral pain. Somatic pain uh, will travel if somebody, never mind cancer, if somebody pricks you with a pin. Okay, it'll go into the uh, spinal cord, go up through the uh, brainstem into the uh, thalamus, into the somatosensory cortex, where you see a homunculus. You, you can see uh, basically your brain is able to tell you within a silly little millimeter, if that, exactly where that pain is coming from. Okay. Visceral pain is entirely different. Visceral pain comes, of course, from the abdomen, where you have you know, pancreas, liver, kidneys, you know, adrenals, and so on. And, and they have large um, membranes around them. And the spinal cord is not able to differentiate on, let's say, the liver capsule this point from this point, it just knows there's something there that hurts. So in the spinal cord, you actually have changes in that it can't interpret the pain. And then the pain is shunted up, of course, rostrally going again through the thalamus to the somatosensory cortex, and all it tells you is you got pain there, but you can't localize it. 